As a best practice, we recommend data denormalization whenever possible. Let's look at how Tenton Data handles the benefits of normalization to see why denormalization is recommended. With normalization, we can update data in real time. While this is critical for transaction processing systems, Tenton Data is a big data analytical system. Real time processing is not performed, so this isn't needed. Normalization preserves data integrity during record updates or additions. In 1010 data, records are not updated individually as they are in a transaction processing system. Instead, data is loaded in bulk, often from an operational data store. The source takes care of data integrity, so we don't need to worry about this. We also discussed how normalization leads to reduced data size. While 1010 data is storing more individual data elements, we take full advantage of columnar storage and compression. With this, storage needs and I.O. time to access data are both greatly reduced. We strongly recommend to normalize tables as they can be read sequentially from storage. Otherwise, if data is normalized across multiple tables, you may have randomized, slower access when joining tables. A single denormalized table is also easier for an analyst writing queries. You don't need to worry about multiple dimension tables and associated join keys. Everything needed to write the query is already available. Denormalization also arranges data for vector-oriented computation, reducing calculation time. More often than not, denormalization will be the right choice when working with 1010 data.